The Shot by Shot app was created as a convenient data entry tool for our subscribers while on the golf course. Our primary objective was to make the app as easy as possible to use. We, this started with the colors and font sizes that can be easily read in bright sunlight. And for golfers like me that need reading glasses, no glasses would be needed on the golf course. Next, we added intelligent defaults and logic that can help reduce the number of clicks or entries whenever possible. We start each round with the basic round information. Today's date is always prompted, but can be easily changed. Home course, once you've added your home course, it will be prompted, but can also be easily changed. 18 holes can be changed to nine holes, front nine or back nine, green speed, tournament or non-tournament, match play versus stroke play. Any and all of these important pieces of round information can be filtered in our analysis, either individually or all together. We then switch to whole information. Here the app follows the flow of your game. On par fours and fives, driving. Tap the screen to open the six driving options. Fairway, we all like this one. Then the fairway misses are good lie, a good opportunity you can easily accomplish your next goal, a bad lie, a poor opportunity it will take a very good shot to accomplish your next goal, be it to hit the green in regulation or advance the ball on a par five. Finally, the three driving errors. The least expensive, the no shot, a ball hit out of play, it's not a penalty, but it requires an advancement shot to return to normal play. The penalty requires a drop, and the lost ball and out of bounds, stroke and distance penalty. Note the skull and crossbones icon. That was my idea. Let's say we had a no shot result. This requires an advancement, and I do so, and I hit it to within 110 yards of the hole in the fairway. The next section is the approach shot. The default is 150 plus or 150 to 175 yards. Why? Because we've learned that it will be the most frequently faced approach distance at every level of the game if a player is playing the appropriate tees or distance for their game. I change the distance to the 100 plus and change the position to fairway. It was set on rough because of the driving error. The penalty second button signifies the result of your approach shot was A, a penalty, or B, poor enough that you have a second approach from greater than 50 yards from the hole. The second distance doesn't matter. We don't enter it. Our system will calculate the strokes gained properly based on what happens next. GIR. The default is no. Because of my driving error and the advancement, I cannot hit the green in regulation, so I leave it as a no. But I did hit the green from 100 plus yards and to 10 feet. Note that the number of putts default is two for obvious reasons, and that prompts a score of a bogey five. But wait, I made that 10 foot putt. Change the number of putts to one, and the score automatically updates to par. Great save. If there are short game shots, you merely indicate whether you successfully hit the green or you missed. That hole finished, we move on to the next hole. Well, it took me several minutes to explain all that. Once you are familiar with the data entry process, it literally takes seconds on each hole. I use the app for all of my rounds and none of my partners ever notice that I'm doing it. You can find links to the app stores for your phone on our website, shopbyshop.com, and register for our one round free trial to experience the app and our strokes gain analysis for yourself. Play well and have fun.